All right, I'll take you in and show you the inside here. All right, so you walk in to your left, um, you've got this um, sofa that has three built-in recliners, um, cabinet storage above, that's your door for the uh, cargo area. Um, you've got the fireplace and some cabinets, Sony TV, more cabinets up top, um, the big bunk up above the cargo area, stainless fridge, it is the four-door fridge, um, has the freezer on top and then two uh, doors for the fridge, literally looks new. Um, over here, you've got the oven and a gas cooktop, a microwave and convection oven, uh, pantry storage up here. And that's probably a foot, maybe 12 inches depth by, I don't know, three foot wide. Um, you've got this one over here that is a little shorter. It's probably six inches depth and again, about three foot wide. And the same thing down here. Um, the little kitchen sink area, you've got three pull out drawers here. And then underneath the sink, you've got um, some pretty decent storage down there underneath the sink as well. Uh, the sink is a stainless and it's a double. So I do have all the original manuals with it. Uh, which is nice. Um, you do have a drawer underneath the oven down there by the floor room. And then over here to the left of the fridge, you've got some more storage. So quite a bit of cabinetry. You got those two, that one, a drawer down there. Um, you got some drawers underneath the sink. Um, you got some up here. I'll open one of those. Let me see. And then you've got this guy, don't forget, whoops, don't forget about this one. So um, this one has your panel where your fuses and stuff are all located, but you do have some storage underneath. And then you've got a shelf there, there, and there. So I'll kinda zoom out and let you see that one. And then there's some above it. Then you walk up uh, to your left, you've got an entrance to the bathroom, toilet, shower, um, love the size, love the height up here. I'm six foot three and I don't feel super cramped up. Um, king bed, of course, there's a sliding pocket door to where you can close that and block off the bathroom from the master bedroom up here. Um, got the sliding wardrobe doors here. So you move those slides. It does have central vac in it too, which is cool. Um, this closet up here is prepped for um, the washer dryer, and we do sell those. So if you guys wanted that, it's something we could help you with. We've got the entertainment area, TV. I'll show you the cargo area right fast. Okay, so there is a portable table um, I've got it set back here right now, but there is a portable table that can go up here in the front area, or you can set it up back here. It's kind of dark in here with the, the beds up. It blocks some of the lighting, but um, you can see it's got sliding glass doors um, in the very back. So if you're trying to keep it AC back here, but you've got your uh, patio door down and set up, you do have sliding doors. Um, there's the door that goes outside. TV, more cabinets, um, and then you have the half bath back here, which is pretty much just a little uh, toilet and a sink and a, a mirror. Again, the garage space is 11 foot. Um, these are electric, so the, the seats, and they convert to beds, and there's one up top, you can kind of see that does lower down. Give me a shout with any questions. Um, my name's Dylan, I'm with Chase Motorsports out of Paducah, Kentucky, and um, we've uh, been in business for, I guess going on 14 years now. So if I can help you out, give me a shout. Have a good evening, bye-bye.